problem 37, chapter 18 of John Cooley, 6th edition. So the question is, how many bulbs, light bulbs, uh, we can connect uh, to 120 volts? This is what is given to us uh, in the power plant. Um, and uh, these light bulbs, the power, so let's write down everything that they, they are giving to us. The power of the light bulb is 100 watt. What is given by the electric company, uh, the potential difference 120 volts. That's what comes in our wall, uh, in our house. And uh, we want to know how many of these light bulbs we can connect so that it's not going to blow the fuse. And the fuse determines the maximum current that can go through this circuit the maximum current that this fuse can stand, in my case, is 15 amps. Okay? So we want to know how many light bulbs, how many, is, I'm calling this number N, how many uh, light bulbs can we have? Okay. Now, the, the, the way they write in web of sign is a, a little uh, misleading because they show you a figure that is not the figure that is going to that you have to think about. Now they show you a figure where they put hair dryer, electric heater. That's the figure that we studied in class. That's not what we are going to do. What we have now is we have this potential difference, 120 volts coming uh, from from the, that's what is given by the the company, you know. And now what they want to tell us with that figure is that we are going to connect our light bulbs like this in parallel. So one is here, another one is there. So just as we did with all those appliances in that problem. Okay? And we want to know how many of these light bulbs we are going to put. That's the question. Okay? Uh, and uh, remember that before going into the into uh, to these um, bulbs, we have a fuse here. Okay. All right. How are we going to do this? Well, let's think first uh, the amount of current that each bulb, each light bulb will draw. How do we get that? Well, remember that power is equal to IV. So each bulb will draw the power, which is 100 watt, divided by that potential difference, 120. So we'll get this number here in amps. Okay? This is the amount of current for a single bulb, but we will need current for this bulb, so it's the current one, current for this one is the current two, current for this one is the current three, and as many bulbs as we want. So we will add up all of these different currents, now all of this current for all of these different bulbs, and this cannot go beyond the maximum current that we can, uh, that, the, that the, the fuse can stand. Okay, so this is the, the, the equation that we'll have to play with. Okay? The maximum we have is 15 amps, the value for the current of the bulb you found there, and now you're going to find how many bulbs you can have. Okay? Now, uh, if you get a, a, not an integer, let's say if you get 9.3, then the number of bulbs, light bulbs that you're going to use is 9. Now you cannot put 9.3 light bulbs. Okay? So that's the, the end of this 